her movements. Yeah, yeah. She probably can't even recall all of her recipes. But somewhere along the way, wisdom going to step out on the porch to meet you. And say, beyond a shadow of a doubt. Yeah, yeah, I remember that part. Huh? Amen. I remember that that was said at that particular juncture huh? that got me to where I am right now. Remember your name. Huh? Remember your name. You're, you're representing me. Right? So when you go out there and show your black side, misrepresenting the address that you come from. Somebody know what I'm talking about. Don't shame my name. And not and to not shame my name is to remember your name. Have yes, I got a witness here? Yeah. I get so tired of females answering to the yeah. Amen yeah. off yeah. alphabets that yeah. are hurled at them. Yeah. Amen on an ongoing and consistent basis. Yeah. I say to myself, honey, stop answering. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, don't, I would go there, but don't make yeah. me go there. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about. You understand, right? God has set the standard. And a wise woman, yeah, yeah, she will build her house. In other words, she will mimic, yeah, what the proverb 31 woman said. Huh? She can't be lazy. She got to work. <laughs> Amen. Sometimes she got to burn the candle at both ends. She got to do it when she don't feel like it. I know I'm talking to some mother. Right? I mean, she got to be there when ain't nobody else there. Amen. She got to be there, right? Amen. I'm, I, I understand, and I, I know there are many uh, situations and circumstances, but long distance, amen, mothering, amen, moves you away from nurture. Amen. Nowadays, uh, that I've heard and I've read, not enough lap time for children. Have a guy with me I can remember my elders, even my own mother That's and right. grandmother, having them babies on their lap. lap yeah. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. It's a form of nurse. Yeah. Right? Now, yeah, we want to hurry up, get them off our lap. Yeah. Get them off our hip. Yeah. 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 Get, them, yeah. get them back in that crib. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. So we can, yeah, yeah. strut our stuff. Yeah. 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 Amen. No, no, no. Generations keep changing, right? Yeah. And like it was when we were coming up yeah. past generations. Yeah. Yeah. We can recognize that from this text, the word says every wise woman, where does wisdom come from? Yeah. That wisdom comes from the law yeah. in this context. Huh? Yeah. Jesus was wise. Yeah. Right? Yeah. In all of his uh in all of his tendencies, yeah. in all of his Human maker, he was wise. That's right. Yeah, even as a boy, yeah. he was yeah. wise. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. And God allowed him to even give instruction to his own mother. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. To remind her, yeah, that he at some point must be about right. my father's business. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Are y'all still with me? Yeah. I said every what every wise woman. Yeah. Right? right? Every wise woman. Yeah. What does she do? Yeah, she builds. In other words, she's industrious. Yeah, yeah she so. takes opportunities. She she uses wisdom to make not only ends meet, but she uses wisdom to make sure her children are taken care of. Yeah. Make sure, yeah, her husband is taken care of. Yeah, yeah. That's that's what she does. Yeah. Why? Because she's operating. Of oh, oh, wisdom. Yes, sir. Wisdom, my brothers and sisters, is the principal thing. Yes, sir. We leave church today, we can recognize how God wants to operate still in the family today. Yes. Are y'all with me there? Yes. The order, as I heard around, the order is uh, WWM. Mm. Right Ryan, he yes. likes WWF. <laughs> And I tell him, boy, it's not real. He said, how can it not be real? I said, because I told you it's not real. But he loved it. But 
WWM is woman, wife, Huh? I wish y'all pray with That's God, God. That's old folk. That's antiquated. That's not of the modern day 21st century thinking. And, and when you deviate from that, you get what we got today. So long, and we keep setting up our own mantras, yeah. setting up our own alphabets, yeah. trying to do away with what God has already established in His Word. The chaos will continue. Yeah. Have a God in this. No need for us to just sit in church Sunday in, Sunday out, all happy clapping. That's all right. We got to leave these four consecrated walls. We got to go back out there to the real neighborhood, right? Into the real workplace, into a real central market, into a real marketplace to where folk do not care about your religious ideology. I'm about to share with you this morning. When you know what you know and what God has revealed to you, then you learn how to stand on that in spite of the popular love or unpopular. You stand on it anyhow because God has been too good for you to turn your back on him and say, I don't want to do it anymore. As a closed in the morning, is that God knows what He's talking about. You know, beyond the shadow of a doubt, if you're not a builder, you're not wise. But if you are a builder, you are wise. Yeah, yeah, that's what He's saying. Saying, in essence, I know what God would have us to do. And I'll follow after His model. He says, listen. This wise woman builds her house. Right, then, but the, but, but the foolish, right. she will tear it down with her own hands. As I close this morning, I'm here to share with you, brothers and sisters, be careful what you do with your hands. The most legacy you leave here on earth will be determined by how you use your hand. Yeah. Yeah, most of what you will establish as the next generation and next generation and next generation legacy as a mother, grandmother, or widower, it doesn't matter. It will be determined in many instances of what you did with your hand. Have I got company up in here? If you understand it, brothers and sisters, you can celebrate the mother assignment that God has blessed her with. Yeah. Watch yeah. what he says. See, the foolish woman will pluck it down with her hand. Yeah. She's so silly and, and caught up in sarcasm. Yeah, and she's so yeah sought after by the wrong men who don't mean her any good. You got to throw the silliness to the side. Stand up on the standards. Yeah, that God had already required in his word. I got any company here. What I like about it, my brothers and sisters, is that we can celebrate. Because we just have to know which category or which side we want to be on. Do I want to be on the wise side? Or be on the foolish side? Or fear was on the foolish side? And she did not operate in God's standard. She did what she wanted to do. Jezebel did not operate by God's standard. She stood, she stood on her own recognizance and ended up pulling the thread from a whole nation. Have I got company here? My brothers and sisters, I may not know your mother's name, but you ought to know this morning which side you're standing on. Have I got company here? I don't mind standing for what I know is right. But God will make a way for me and he'll make a way for you. Have I got any company here? I can remember my mama clearly saying right over there in Queen City when the storm will begin to rise. She said, Rav, y'all get somewhere and sit down. That's the Lord. 
power through you. And I'm not just telling you. If you don't pray to me, it don't matter. I got so much to be thankful. Am I got a witness here? I said, I got so much to be thankful. Am I got a witness here? I don't mind. I, I know mother that said I had to be the mother and the father. 